Good morning, everybody. So today I'm going to talk about being positive and having a positive mental attitude toward everything that you do in life, even if the negative is bringing you down, even if someone says that you can't do this. It's impossible for you to do this. Well, I'm going to tell you, even when someone says that to you, it's really not true. Because anybody can do anything that another man can do. And some people are going to say, no, no, that's not true. Well, it pretty well is true. Physically true, unless you're unfortunate and you can't physically do things, then, then you're not going to be able to do things. But there is certain things that you will be able to do that other people can't do. Some people got their brain and they're so smart, right? You can't do those things that they can do. Those people made a nuclear bomb and it did a lot of damage. Do we really want to do that kind of thing anyway? No, we're not going to try to do that kind of thing. And that's the smart people of the earth, right? That have done that sort of thing. Now, physically, people are going to say you can't do something. And they're going to say you can't do something mentally as well. But when you strive and believe in yourself, you keep going forward and forward. Even if you fail, it doesn't matter. Those who have never failed have really never succeeded at anything in their life. Some people are given things. Here you go, here you go. Oh, I'm going to baby you all your life. And they've never been through any kind of struggle, right? They've been given so much stuff in life from their their parents and whatnot. And something that people think they're better than other people that have that. Well, where would they be if they had a hardship in life and they had to struggle? Do you think they're going to be able to struggle through things like other people have in their life? Do you think they're strong enough to do that? Do you think they could believe in themselves enough to do that? My answer to you is, I don't really think so. Most people, when they get put in hard situations in life, they curl up like a little ball, they bury their head in the sand, they don't want to hear it. And that doesn't mean it's not true. They've been given everything in life. Except real strength and independence. Which, what would you people rather have? Would you rather have everything given to you? Or would you rather have the strength building up over the years, over time? And I'm talking inner strength. Would you rather have your experiences build up and build up and get strong from that?
You know, I spoke to my blood father one time in my life, and he said, what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. I'm thinking, well, yeah, I guess you're right, because I'm still alive and I'm stronger. When you go through so many situations in life to where you're ready to give up. But something inside you says, go forward. You can do it. This is nothing. And then you believe it inside. And then you actually keep going forward. Even if you're failing, it doesn't matter. Those are situations that just make you stronger. Because when you can overcome those situations, you can almost overcome really anything that comes at you. And most people are not like that. There's very few people that can actually strive through the biggest hardships. There's so many things that can bring you down in life. Death of a family member, breaking up with your girlfriend or your wife. Most people, they can't take that. shut right down and what do they do they don't leave the house anymore sometimes they stop going to work all kinds of things can happen a lot of people actually commit suicide don't they Which is the most unfortunate thing. Those kind of feelings are real. And they're not real at the same time. You have to keep those toxic people and those feelings out of your life. Otherwise, they will. They will destroy you if you let it. But some people haven't been through the hardships in life to make themselves strong enough to overcome those feelings. So they turn to drugs and alcohol. You can have all the money in the world and doesn't mean you're strong inside. It can make you weaker because you haven't gone through any kind of any kind of adversity. You have no endurance in life. Some people they think they're better than others. I'll tell you this right now. <laughs> nobody, nobody in this world is better than anybody else, no matter what. Okay? No matter what. If someone tells you you can't do something, like I've told people, oh, you'll never bench 350 pounds, or you'll never bench 300, or some people are saying, oh, you'll never bench 400. Well, if that's what you really want to do in life, who's going to stop you? Somebody telling you you can't? Really? They used to say it was impossible for a man to run the four minute mile. Impossible. Then somebody broke it. And now everybody does that. Not everybody, but everybody who believes it and they train for that breaks that four minute mile that they said that nobody could break.
You guys ever heard of the story of the bumblebee? Well, they say it's physically impossible for a bumblebee to fly. His wings are too small for his body. Right? I guess nobody told me he couldn't fly. Because if they told me he couldn't fly, then he wouldn't be able to fly, right? See? So if someone tells you you can't do something, and you believe them, well, guess what? You are already beaten, and you'll never do what you want to do or what you feel like you need to do. Just because you're believing in them and not yourself. So you have to believe in yourself to succeed at anything in this world. Depends on what your goals are. Do you want to succeed? What do you want to succeed at? When my son was born, when I was 25 years old, I said, well, I have to do something now. Um, I've been doing sales for a long time, and it just <clears throat> it didn't really work out all the time. I did sales a little bit after, but it was always somebody that was like, oh, they don't want you to succeed at it. So guess what? Your deals are going to go bad no matter what. Just because they're, they don't want you to succeed, or they're ripping you off, or what not? You get that negative attitude when that happens. So then guess what happens? Your own self brings you right down to the fucking ground. And once you're at that negative level, you're into that depression mode. So hard to pick up again, isn't it? You gotta wanna pick it up. You gotta wanna get out of that hole. Because that's the worst place to be is depression and high anxiety. Right? It's like you'd rather be angry than have depression. Okay? Because your emotion can replace the other emotion. If you're sad, get angry. Then you're not sad anymore. If you're sad, get angry. And you won't be fucking sad anymore. You'll be angry. You'll be angry at yourself. Angry at the situation. And you will pull through it. People tell me, Oh, you're never going to learn this trade. Ah, you can't do it. You can't. You can't do it. You're never going to learn this trade. You're going to... You're going to be mixing cement for the rest of your life. That's it. And I was like, oh yeah? Give me that fucking sword. Start learning how to do that. Right? Who are these people that tell me that I can't fucking do something? Right? They tell you you can't do something, and you believe them, then you're beaten already. That's it. It's over. But if you believe in yourself and you keep learning something and trying something, because you will get better no matter what you do. Anything you do, you're going to get better at it as long as you practice. Perfect practice makes almost perfect results. And Nothing's perfect, is it? So nobody's perfect at anything. You may think they are, but no. They're almost maybe perfect, which makes them look perfect at something. So as long as you can get halfway there at something, then it's a lot, a lot better than being... 
insufficient at something. So that's how you do it. You got to believe in yourself to strive forward. Let's say you're trying to get better at weightlifting. Okay, well, you have to practice, don't you? Right? You have to heal your body up. You have to heal the body up. You have to build your body. Okay? You have to build your coordination up in your hands to do things. If you want to be a runner, you have to build up to that, don't you? Now you got to start small. Mm. You got to crawl before you walk. Walk before you run. Run before you fly. But you can't fly, right? Well, in my mind, I can fly. So that means I can fly. But I'm not going to try to fly off a building or anything like that because I'm not negative anymore about anything so even though things come at you at me we have to be positive don't we otherwise they're going to beat us because they want you down people want to squash you like a bug it could be your wife it could be your girlfriend if they think that you need them mm, they will squash you like a bug you won't have a good time at all. You want to have respect. You don't want to have love. Okay? What's the, You want love or respect? The respect is going to bring you farther in life than any love. A woman has to respect you. She don't respect you, that's it. You're not gonna have a good time. If people don't respect you in your workplace and they're jealous of you, mm, you're not gonna have a good time. So if you feel like you need to change something, you have to do it. You have to make that change. Otherwise, you're going to be stagnant. And where does that get you? Gets you running in circles. You're only in the same spot. But you never go forward. But you get tired and then you start going backwards, backwards. That's what happens. So you always have to move forward. If you don't like the situation you're in, you have to change it. That's it. Because no one, haters, your haters, will never give you credit where credit's due. No matter how good you do, no matter what you do, they don't say it. It's like, they won't say it. You say, well, they say, you say this and this. I say, listen, I've done it. No, you haven't done it. Well, yeah, I've done it. No, you haven't done it. No matter what you've done. You could have it on video. And they don't want to see it. Because. Because <laughs> no one's going to give you credit. <laughs> when they don't like you. Okay? That's the way it is. Because you can make them feel smaller. Sometimes. And they've done better than you. But they feel small. See how that works? Because they haven't been through any adversity. They have no endurance or anything. Everything's been given to them. So when they see you come around and you're a threat to them, you're better, and they can't control you, well, they're going to squash you like a bug. 
Okay, they're going to bring you down to a level that you don't want to be at. So when you're in situations like that, you have to change it. You have to, otherwise. <laughs> you need eating crow. And that's the truth. Most people are going to be jealous of you. When you're doing good at something, they don't like it. They're going to want to stop it. That's it. The only thing you can do is change it. And yet it's hard sometimes, right, to leave someone that is not good for you. Okay? It's very hard. It's hard not to chase. But actually, it's easy. You don't need that negative in your life. You don't need any negative people telling you that you can't do something in life. When you believe yourself that you can, and you do it. Does it matter that they don't give you credit? No, it doesn't. Because they're never going to give you credit anyway. Right? That's why being alone in life is good. Usually good things come around eventually. But if they don't, it doesn't really matter. Just do it yourself. Do the things that you feel that you should do. If you have a family, take care of your family, because they're first, right? Always. But you still have to take care of yourself. If you don't like the situation you're in, you can still take care of your family. If you're not there, you don't need to be squashed like bugs. It's very unhealthy. And that's what brings a strong man down, is when he allows himself to be squashed like a bug. So you have to change your situations in life, and things will get better, always. And don't let anyone tell, that you, tell you that you cannot do something. You can't do that. Because I can do it, you can't do it. That's bold. That's a bunch of BS. Okay. The natural man can do anything and it lasts. It's those people that are on drugs. That that's a temporary that's the temporary quick fix that doesn't last. Peace, everybody. That's positivity and negativity all in one, but you gotta keep being positive in life and move forward. Otherwise, the negative will bring you down, and you don't wanna be down. And you gotta make yourself strong enough to pick yourself up if there's no one else to help you pick up. Most people have someone to pick them up. few will be able to do it on their own.